Hey, welcome my math ninjas. I have a really challenging division problem for you today. This is a one, two, three, four, five digit number divided by a two digit number. Quite challenging. And this number right here, it's not like 14 or 25. It's the number 67. So my trick on solving this a little easier is just to do a little bit of figuring on the side. So I'm going to go ahead and do some multiplication with 67 just so that I can make this process go a little bit smoother and faster. So this is actually, this is my way of doing it. As you know, in mathematics, there are so many different ways on how to achieve the same answer. So let's go ahead and begin. I'm going to do 67 times 2. So 7 times 2 is 14. Carry the 1. 6 times 2 is 12. And then 13. Let's do 67 times 3. So 7 times 3 is 21. Carry the 2. 18, 19, 20. 67 times 4. 7 times 4 is 28. Put the 2 up here. 6 times 4 is 24. 25, 26. Let's do one more. 67 times 5. 7 times 5 is 35. Whoop. 5. Put the 3 up there. 6 times 5 is 30. And that would be 33. So we have all of our hard work out. Now we just throw it in like a puzzle. So 67 cannot go into 1. 67 cannot go into 15, 67 can go into 156. Just cover these other numbers up if they get a little confusing for you. Don't even pay attention to them right now. So the closest number that I can go to 156 would be 134. If I did three, that would be 201. So let's do uh, 67 times two. And I put the two right here. Don't put it above the one or the five. You need to put it above the six. So I put the two right here. The reason I put it above the six is because I'm dealing with this whole number right there. So two times 67 would be 134. And then I subtract. Six minus four is two. Five minus three is two. All right. Now I bring down the next number right here. And now I have 224. See how easy it is? I'm just looking over here to see if there's a number that matches close to 224. Um, and this is a six. I, I should write a little neater for you. It looks like we're going to use three. So let's use three. Three times 67 would be 201, just like this. Subtract. Four minus three. 4 minus 3. 4 minus 1 is 3. I had 3 in my mind for the answer. It's been a long day. And then uh, bring the 2 down right here. And now I bring that last number down. Alright, got to make math fun. So what number would that be? 268 is still too high. We still need to work with the number 3. So I put 3 times 67 is 201 right there. Subtract it. 5 minus 1 is 4. 3 minus 0 is 3. We can't go any farther. This is our remainder. So we put the remainder right up here. 34. So we have 233 with remainder 34. Hey, thank you very much for watching the show today. Um, I hope you're getting outside and enjoying the weather. Um, you need to take some breaks because um, just got to get some exercise out there. Also, I hope that you are having a good time with your friends out there and your family and maybe even doing some drawing like I am. And I just am very thankful that I can do some videos for you because it's you that makes the difference and you help support my show. So thank you very much for doing that. And I hope I will see you next time. Make sure you check out my other videos. Adios. Have a great day. Bye-bye.